In this lecture, we learn about the buttons. Buttons is the next standard element used in SCADA system. You can find this in Windows objects. We we'll draw the button. After we draw the button, we see the button configuration. We have the text, the font, the colors, the authorization. So which operator can operate with this button and some other things but let's go to properties and let's configure this element directly with all elements we see that we have the tab geometry the geometry is the same like in static text and IO field the colors is nearly the same the effects we have the color scan, we have transparency, but we have also the WinCC style, so we can draw the global or the classic view. The font is the same like in static text, the flashing is the same, the miscellaneous is a bit different, so we can create the shortcut for our button, so if we, for example, make the Control uh, H, so we can make the the shortcut on the keyboards for this button. We can also activate the electronic sign for this button, but it's additional things. Now in pictures, you see the different tab if uh, then in static text. We have the picture status on and picture status off. So if we turn on or turn, turn off, for example, motor, we can create some pictures. So our button will display different kind of pictures inside or this display different colors or something. When we open with double click the button configuration, we see all basic configuration for these elements. But if you want to make some actions with this button, we need to go to events tab, it's the new tab, and in mouse we can create some action the action the click or unclick from the mouse or make the keyboard or make the focus actions but let's make the mouse action for this element and this action will make the right value into our tags so we go to press left because we can make the action on the left button on the on our mouse and make the right buttons actions so we create the direct connection action on the left side we have the source so we can make the what should go to target for the right side our target is our test tag test tag let's make the first one okay we choose the tag so on the left side we need to make what should go to our tag one let's go with number 11 now we save this window and let's make the runtime. Now we see that in our tag we have the 50 value, but after we click the start, this button, the new button, we have value 11. Now if we put 30, we make the start again and this button moved 11 into our tag tag 1 
is the basic functionality for the tags. Tags can be used also for the change windows, change uh, the colors for the elements, or change, for example, some or uh, or create some uh, Visual Basic script or C script and make some more functionality under this button but in the simplest way the button can make the action and actions is very useful for creating the visualization